President Muhammad Buhari joined Muslims all over the world to mark this year's Eid al-Kabir. The president, his family members, and some top government officials observed the Salah within the precinct of the presidential villa Abuja. His wife Aisha and son Yusuf were among those who took part in the prayers led by the chief imam of the State House Mosque, Abdul Wahid Suleiman. Shortly after the prayers, Buhari witnessed the slaughtering of the Salah rams and thereafter took group pictures with family members. Those who participated in the prayers, including the president, wore face masks and maintained social distancing with the arrangement of their prayer mats in accordance with the guidelines issued by the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19. The president expressed delight that some stolen assets have been recovered, sold, and proceeds put into the Treasury single account, which is inaccessible to the corrupt persons involved. When asked how he felt about recent revelations coming out from the EFCC and the NDDC, the president said... Nigerians know that we have done our best. We want uh, security, prosperity, and the well-being of all Nigerians. What is coming up in Northwest and North Central is uh, very, very uh, disturbing indeed. I believe the military and the police and other law enforcement agencies could do much better. They could do much better, but uh, uh, we are keeping them on the alert all the time to do their duties. There has been abuse of trust by people trusted by the previous administration and this administration. A number of assets have been recovered and some money. And I said assets should be sold and the money be put in treasury single account. First Lady of Nigeria, Dr. Mrs. Aisha Muhammad Buhari, is wishing all Nigerians a happy Eid al Kabir. She called on women, particularly, to take care of their family against this pandemic. And she prays that God Almighty will bring us to the end of this pandemic very soon so that we go back to normal life as usual.